Hello guys, my name is Jose, I'm living in Houston, Texas, and today I'm going to show you how to realign the sensors for your garage openers. Maybe you have one of those in your house, Chamberlain, Craftsman, Leadmaster, or any or Genie, or Marante, any, any opener, but sometimes we have some problem to close the door. And today I'm going to show you how to fix some, some things very quick. Remember, if you have in Houston, Texas, in you wanted to replace your opener, you can call me and we can help you with that. If you have any issue that you cannot figure out what's the problem, you can call me anytime or you can give me a test message, uh, feel free, okay? So, this is a typical problem that, that most people have sometimes in the United States and I'm going to show you. So, here's my, my opener. This is my my back right there. So it's working fine, right? Can you see? My door is fine. Now watch. The the door the lights is on. So that means it's power, it's electricity, it's supposed to be everything, everything's working fine. But sometimes when I'm gonna close my door, it this this happen. You see this happen? It's blinking the light. That, that blinking means something. So it must be something wrong with the sensors. So sometimes people, what they did is just put this uh, and they push the remote to put it down. And they sometimes the remote go up. See? Let's go up itself. Look how what this is going to do the, the opener. So that means. For some reason, just because the door is too old, uh, the sensors move, or it's uh, or it's a, or it's kind of destruction. Something is on destruction on the sensors, so you must to fix that thing. Uh, we have the sensors right here. Here is one. So you see, this uh, uh, they can be uh, they have a little structure. So. Now we want to make sure it, 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 it's okay. So right here is another sensor. These sensors, and you see this sensor is loose. So that's why we have the problem. So now we need to put back these sensors so the door is working fine. And it's pretty easy. So we get this sensor back. We lose it right here. And then we tie it, the sensor. There you go. So as you see, there is a light. A light is a green light. It's a green light right there. So this light it must to be solid. If it's blinking, it's, it's bad. Okay. And also, you have to make sure the tracks is not losing. If it's losing, if it's move, for example, this door need to be a little adjusted. So what we're gonna do is to get my tool back. Fix the problem. So that's the sensor. You see, now it's strong. So it's not gonna move the sensor. The move the sensor is okay. So this means if this is blinking, remember is is something wrong with the uh, is uh, any instruction. Now, right here, this sensor. Let me see if I can move this. No, I cannot move it. This light. This sensor has a light. Uh, it's a yellow light. Yellow light does mean it's electricity on the opener. So, so once we check already openers and the sensors, we're gonna go and check for ourselves right here and the wall panel. See, it's working. It's working properly. You see, the door is going down. The, the door is going down. Thank you. You see, it's working properly now. As you can see, up, stop it. Stop. It's simple like that, guys. If you're in Houston area and you need service for your garage doors, just give me a call and please subscribe to my channel. Thank you. See you in the next video.